And you have to remember, I'm not very good at shunting, my friends. Um, oh, wow, there's another steam train. There's another engine. It's, a, it's an AF. <laughs> Everyone, my name is LaserJet and welcome back to Train Sim World 3! Do you know what? It has been a while since we've done a Train Sim World 3 video, but never mind. Uh, we're back and today we're trying out a brand new route uh, that's just been released. And also, we're going to be trying out a new steam train in Train Sim World 3. <laughs> so we are here at Peak Forest Railway and we're going to be trying out this! Now this is an LMS Fowler Class 4F. Now I have to say, it is so cool to actually have another steam engine in Train Sim Mold 3. I mean, don't get me wrong, the Jubilee Class and the 8F Class, they are very good, but we want more steam trains. And uh, happily, uh, Dovetail Games have done it. They've made another steam engine, and I have to say, it does look really, really cool. And actually, can we actually... <laughs> oh yes, we can! Um, can we unscrew anything? No, I don't think we can. Do you know what would be a really cool feature in Train Sim World 3? Uh, if you can actually, like, oil the, uh, uh, the rods. So you take off the little cap things and you can actually put oil in the rods. So, uh, stop the metal from, uh, getting stiffened up and stuff. That would be, that'd be a really cool feature in Train Sim World 3 if, if, if you could do that, but never mind. So let's drive the Fowler F4. So let's open the door and climb up and close the door. Can we have a look around the cab? Yes, we can. Ooh! Look at this. This looks very nice. And we got my mate Pete. How you doing, Pete? Oh, God, he looks he looks super hungover. So we're gonna try out the uh, the four F Fowler. So where do I actually? Is there a way for me to actually sit? Sit in? Oh no, we just stand. Okay. Uh, let's have a look outside. Ooh, very nice. Let's. Uh, I want to do a, t a test of the whistle. See what it sounds like. Hey. hey. Oh, I'm going to have so much fun with this engine. So let's have a look at our um, task. What we have to do is uh, stop at location, couple up to some uh, trucks. Stop at location, stop at location, uncouple uh, trucks, uh, stop at location. Oh, wow, we've got, uh, we got a lot to do. Uh, let's see if we can try and do them without any issues. Let's release our brake and put the injector on. Uh... Oh, this is very exciting. Uh, put the reverser in forward. Uh, for some reason, we're already starting to slightly move, although it is going downhill. So let's give ourselves a little bit of acceleration. Here we go. We're off. Do a double toot to let people know that this train is moving. Oh, man. This is, this, this is amazing. Can I have a look outside? <laughs> yes! Lead out the window. Oh, we're, we're speeding a little bit. Let me apply a little bit of braking. There we go. Can I look around the other side? Oh, I think I can. Yes! Oh, this is so cool. I forgot how much fun uh, Train Sim World 3 is. I mean, and how much detail there is uh, to Train Sim World 3. I'll tell you what, the sound effects for the uh, 4F Fowler are actually not that bad. They're not bad at all. Do another two at the whistle. Although well, I need to put a lamp down to let me know that. Is that a light engine? I don't know. I think it doesn't need to be in the middle. I think. I, th I, don't, I don't know. I think that's light engine. Oh, and we've got a red signal. Uh, apply our uh, brakes. We've got to stop at a location. Because we've got a red signal, so... Oh, we're doing this properly. I have to remember, this is Train Sim World, Oliver. It's not Train Sim Related Classics where you can just do what you want. You've got to follow by the rules in Train Sim World 3. Which gives you a bit more driving realism, doesn't it? What a real train driver should do. And what he shouldn't do. So let's... Stop about there. Perfect. Objective complete. Oh my god, I was like eight yards from the signal. Uh, now where do we have to go? Oh, we've got to go backwards. Okay. Uh, put the loco in backwards. Or reverse is the right word to say. And give it an acceleration. Release the brakes. And let's get going. Another two at the whistle. I do like the chuffing sound of the, of the Fowler. Ooh, <laughs> a little bit fast there. Uh, let's accelerate just a little bit more. Did I even like... Are the points automatic or do I have to set the points? I've just realised. Do I have to set the points myself? Oh, no, it doesn't automatically. That's good. That's good. For a second, I thought I was going into the wrong siding. Let's get a nice, uh, like, 
low angle wheel shot. There we go. Look at that. Oh, yes. It's nice to have a, not a big steam engine, but more like a, like a medium sized engine. Because you've got the small engines, which are the tank engines. And you've got the big tender engines, which are the express trains. But it's nice to have something in between, like a, like a medium sized locomotive. And, and I think the, uh, the 4F Fowler is perfect. So we're about to couple up to some freight, which I believe is, which is these guys looking good. Um... We are, are we going, we're going slightly uphill, which is good, which is slowing us down a bit, but we need to apply my brakes just a little bit so, and see how well my shunting skills uh, has still, oh wait, I stopped too, stops too suddenly, um, oh, oh, there we go, <laughs> uh, and then we couple up, lovely, there we go, we, we've hooked up, objective completed, haha, <laughs> I completed objective, um, so now I've got to go forwards. Uh, let me just have a look at my thing. Stop at location. Stop at location. And then uncouple. Good. So I'm doing a bit of uh, doing yard shunting work. Good. So uh, let's release the brakes. Go forward. A nice few toots to let people know that this train is now moving. Once again. Oh, wait. Hold on. I need to set the uh, lamps. There we go. We're, we're a freight train. Hey. Let's go full power to see if that will help us. There we go. That's what we're looking for. Oh, the chuffing sounds are absolutely amazing on this uh, on this 4F Fowler. Do you I think we're doing well? Uh, we'll uh, get Pete to shovel some coal. Do you want, go on, Pete. Uh, we need to, we need some coal uh, going. So, um, so so get working, Pete. There we go. Lovely. Good man. Um, I'm, I'm just a bit worried that we might have a red signal up ahead. So I'm just a little bit worried. I'm, I'm, do, I'm doing everything very... Uh, I'm, 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 I'm taking this very seriously. We've got to be very, very uh, careful here. But the, the amount of detail in this and the sound effects, I think it's. I think this is a great little DLC. Well, when I say little, this, 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 this DLC is huge. I mean, this is absolutely amazing. The sound effects are good. The detail is good. The lighting is good. Do another two at the whistle. Do a nice long two. <laughs> this is so fun. Uh, okay, apparently we've got a stop here now, so let's um, apply my brakes a little bit. There we go. Oh, the weather's starting to change a little bit, so let's apply brakes. Fully, fully braking. Fully brake, brake. Oh, I've missed it. Oh, dear. Why are my brakes not working? Brakes on. Stop. Why is my train not stopping? Stop, train. Stop. Um, is this the weight of the trucks? They're pushing me. So, uh, handbrake on the trucks. All handbrakes on. Oh, hard brakes on! Stop! Stop! We've overshot! No! Why is my train not stopping? Stop! Stupid trucks! Stop! Oh dear, we've we've we we've, we've we've overshot quite a bit. I might have um might have miscalculated. Uh, <laughs> oh well, right. Let's release all the brakes uh, on the trucks. Um. Wow, that, that didn't go very well, did it? So, brakes released, uh, train in reverse, brakes off. And um, I'm still learning. This is, the, this is the first time I'm using this, so I don't know how good the brakes are on this thing. So, I'm still learning, my friends. <laughs> Let's go backwards a little bit. Just just a smidge. Um, how much did I overshot? Oh, God, I've really overshot, didn't I? <laughs> but no, this is actually still a really nice engine. Dovetail Games... I think you've done good. You've you've won my approval. I mean, I think this is good. Yeah, I think we'll stop there. Do you think that'll be enough? So let's apply our brakes. Uh, full brakes. There we go. Um, I don't know if they're gonna. I don't know if the train's gonna stop, but we'll see. Uh, oh no, it's stopping. It's stopping. That's good. Um, it does take a while, though, doesn't it? There we go. Hey, objective complete. Just. Um, oh, it wants me to go backwards again. Why does it want me to go backwards? Where am I going? Wow. Isn't that the side I literally just came out from? <laughs> I have no idea. So we're going backwards now. Okay, so um, we'll just, let's just continue going backwards. Fair enough. Let's, let's, let's go backwards again. There we go. Do a little two of the whistle. Lovely. Let's get like a nice cool wheel and funnel shot. So if we press F1. There we go. Ooh. That looks so cool. That's amazing. Do you know what? I'm just having so much fun with the 4F Fowler. I think it's a really nice little engine. Although, so far, we've made a few mistakes. We've uh, gone over the uh, the stopping point. But that's okay. Uh, it says we've got a red signal. No, oh, no, actually, no. It says we've got a green signal. Okay, that's good. Do a nice long two. Although, we are running low on steam. So, uh, 
We need to put the dampers on. We need more coal in the boiler. So come on, Pete, get shoveling, old friend. Um, the reverse down just a little bit. Although we don't want to go too fast. Put both dampers up, actually. There we go. Both dampers are up. Uh, Pete is now shoveling the coal because we are running low on um, on PSI, aren't we? So we need to get more uh, more steam in, in, in the engine. Do you know what? I think I might be getting better at this. I mean, granted, I am a complete noob, but... It's a learning curve, isn't it, Oliver? Because every single train you drive in Train Sim World, each train is completely different. Right, so let's have a look and see what siding we're on. Um, or what siding we're going to. Uh, and we're going to go over there. So we're going to do like a weird snaky uh, manoeuvre. Can we get like a shot from the signal box? Yeah, let's get like a, a signal box shot. And uh, got the signalman waving going, come on, you're all right. You're all right, come on. Uh, reverse in, you're all good, you're all good Wait, no, sorry, we were on this siding, I think And um, now we're on this siding So it's, so, so we're, we're actually moving trucks around Excellent, Oliver, excellent work So go for a little bit more speed A little bit more And a little bit more So what we're doing is we're getting trucks ready for the next train I think that's what we're doing Mmm, excellent I think that's plenty of stopping distance now, so let's apply our brakes. Uh, although I have to be honest, the brakes on the on the 4F aren't exactly very good. So maybe we should put the train in forward and accelerate forward. Maybe that might help us stop. So let's do that. Oh yeah, there we go. Uh oh. <laughs> oh! My wheels have stopped turning! Oh god! What have I done? Stop! We've got, we've got to get the train to stop. Um, sander. Which one's the sand? I don't know which one the sander is. Um, sander front. No, that's that's the front sander. We want the back. Um, no, I think we're all right, though. I think we'll stop him. There we go. <laughs> I don't know why my wheels are... My wheels have locked up. Um, there we go. We've stopped. Hey! hey! And now we've got to uncouple stuff. Uh, apparently, we've got to uncouple the brake van. So, there we go. Is that all right? Yeah, that's good. And I think we've got to take the brake van back to its home. So training forward, brakes are off, and away we go. There we go. Oh, that was a bit of a sudden acceleration, wasn't there? Um, but we have got a red signal at 400 yards, so we've got to be very careful because my brakes aren't very good on this engine, apparently. Let's get like another outside view. Oh, we've got a roof view. Ah, that's cool. I like that. Uh, right. Apply brakes just a little bit. And you have to remember, I'm not very good at shunting, my friends. Um, oh, wow, there's another steam train. There's another engine. It's, a, it's an 8F. Give uh, the 8F another whistle. Right, 8F, hello. Right, damper's off. Uh, apply my brakes just a little bit. Uh, Pete, you can stop shoveling coal now. Um, or you can keep on shoveling. There we go. Good. <laughs> I like how Pete is like looking out the window. So that AF that just passed us, I think that's the train that's going to be taking our freight, I think. I could be completely wrong. Uh, but now, uh, we need to stop just before the signal. So I'm being very careful here because I don't want to over, overshoot the, um, the, the signal. So about, I mean, oh, stop too soon. There we go. Never mind. A little bit more. And stop. That's perfect. Oh, yeah. Look at that. That's perfect. Hey! Right. Now we want to go backwards again. Doing a lot of backwards and forwards right now, aren't we? Um, although we're shunting. We're, we're shunting, Oliver. That's what, what's what we got to do. So now we've got to put the brake van with the other brake vans. Whoa! A little bit of wheel slip. Did not mean to do that. That was a bit, uh, a bit too much power there, wasn't there, Mr. Oliver? Oh, yes, it was. Right, so we've got to go nice and easy. Not too fast, not too fast. Um, oh dear, we've uh, we've missed the uh, we've uh, we, we've made a mistake. We've missed we've missed the uh, we've missed the siding. I forgot to switch the point. I thought the points would go automatically. I guess this this is the only switch point that did not switch automatically. Oh dear. All right, this has delayed us a little bit. But never mind. I mean, let's be honest. We've all done it where we've gone over those points and we thought um, the points were set for us but they are actually haven't been set. We've we've all done it. We've all done it. Switch points. There we go. Lovely. I mean we've all we've all done it, haven't we? So put the train in reverse. 
No, that's forward. I'm going backwards. Go backwards. Back, 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 back. There we go. Good. So I think this brake van needs to go with the other brake vans. Good. Um, so I think... Uh, do, I, do I have to couple them? Apparently I've got to couple them up. Okay, fair enough. Okay, here we go. So apply the brakes a little bit. Not too much. Oh, there we go. So I'm, st I'm still experimenting. It's, it's quite... Um, it's very different driving steam trains in Train Sim World than in Train Simulator. It's very different. And couple up. Can I couple you up? Perfect. <laughs> Lovely. I've coupled up. Now what do I do? Do I just, do I just have to wait? Uh, couple up to... Oh, there we go. It's just taking a while for it, for a while for it to load. And then uncouple this brake van. Lovely. Beautiful. And we've got to go forward this time. How many tasks have we got to do? We've got to do two more tasks. Stop at location and stop at location. Okay, looking good. We're doing very well. We may have a, we, 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 we have, we've had a few mistakes. But we're getting there now, aren't we? Yes, we are. I'm still learning. Right, now we can have only one uh, headlamp because um, it's a light engine. So we've got to stop at the exact location that we just were. So that's good. I'm going to look out the window again. Apply my brakes a little bit. Get it down under under five miles per hour. That's eight, seven, six. There you go, five. Lovely. Then we'll stop right about there, I think. Oh, yes. Bosh. God, I'm a good driver. Uh, now we need to switch those points to there. And I've got to stop there. So let's just see if the points are set. Nope, those ones aren't. So I need to switch those points, which it won't let me for some reason. Points. Switch. 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 Oh, I'll have to do it manually. Uh, so those points are fine. Those points are fine. These points are not fine. We need to... Oh, they're stuck. Why are they stuck? Left. Aha! There we go. I've done it. It's all good. We've done it. Right. Brakes off. Uh, train in reverse. Throttle up. Go. Oh! Little bit of wheel slip there. Careful, Oliver. Careful. <laughs> oh, dear. Let's have a quick look on the map. It should say that we're going to be going into this siding. Yes, we are. Perfect. That's exactly what I'm supposed to be doing. So I'm now bringing the engine back to its lovely siding. Very nice. We'll let, let it rest its wheels. Although we didn't really do much. But we, um, what we did is we moved um, some freight trucks from one siding to another. And then uncoupled its brake van. Didn't really do much though, did we? But never mind. I still had lots of fun. So we'll park it right about there. Right where the buffers are. Good. Hey, hey. And, uh... Uh, what did I get? Did, do I get a medal or something? I got a gold medal! Yeah! I may not be very good at shunting, but I'm very good at doing this, which it, which technically is shunting or moving stuff around, but I got a gold medal! Yeah! But there we are. That was me having a go on the 4F Fowler on the Peak Forest Railway, the new DLC for Train Sim World 3. But if you guys want to get this DLC, I'll leave a link in the description below so you can buy it on Steam. Uh, I highly recommend it. This is a great little route. And also, it's nice to have a, another Steam engine on Train Sim World 3. We, 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 we were wondering if we were going to have any more Steam trains uh, in Train Sim World 3. But Dovetail Games have done it. We've, we've got another Steam engine, the 4F Fowler. Or the Fowler 4F, you can pronounce how you want. But that concludes this video, my friends. I hope you guys did enjoy it. Make sure you click that subscribe button. Follow me on Twitter and Twitch and Instagram. All the links are in the description. Thank you again so much for watching. Have a wonderful day, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye! this stuff um oh oh there we go <laughs> maybe <laughs> <laughs>